When the ice bed cow dung dried and burnt into ashes is used as tooth powder, it is a very antiseptic tooth powder. Similarly, uh, there are many things, many injunctions in the Vedas which may apparently appear as contradiction, but they are not contradiction. They are uh, on experience, on transcendental experience. Just like a father says uh, to, a, to his child that, my dear child, you take this hold. It is very nice. And the child takes believing the father, authority. Uh, the father says, uh, the child knows that my father, he is confident that my father will never give me anything which is poison. Therefore he accepts it blindly, without any reason, without any analysis of the food, whether it is pure or impure. Uh, you have to believe in such a way. Uh, you go to a hotel because it is licensed by the government. You have to believe when you take food stuff there, it is nice, it is pure, or it is antiseptic, or it is. But how do you know it? The authority. Because this hotel is authorized by the government, it has got license. Therefore, you believe. Similarly, Shabda Praman means as soon as there is evidence in the Vedic literature, this is this, here that, that. Then your knowledge is perfect because you are accepting things from the perfect source. Similarly, Krishna, Krishna is accepted as the Supreme Personality of Godhead. Whatever he says, Ah, it is all right. Accept. I was doing said at last. Sarva Mehitam Ritanamanne. My dear Krishna, whatever you say, I accept it. That should be our thing. Ah. Why should we bother about researching ah, when the evidence is there from the authority? Uh, to save time, to save trouble, one has to accept the authority, actual authority. Uh, this is the Vedic process. And therefore Veda says, Sadvigyanatam sa guru meima vigacet. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare.